Hey folks, how's it going? It's Jason here. I'm doing a beer review today on Dogfish Head 60 Minute IPA. Um, this is a beer that uh, I have tried before and I like it, so I want to do a beer review on it. Um, it uh, has to be the most bitter beer that I've ever tried. It has an IBU of 60 um, bitterness units. Uh, the most bitter I think I've tried was 58 which was the Imperial Stout, which was really heavy in alcohol, but also very bitter. But this one uh, is really delicious, and um, today I'm going to be reviewing it. Um, it's uh, a little bit of information about it. It's uh, brewed in Milton, Delaware, um, and it's uh, India Pale Ale, brewed by the Dogfish Head Brewing Company. All right, well, without further ado, I want to just jump right in and try this beer. Um, so here we go. Wow, nice foamy head there. Uh, lots of carbonation, as you can see. Uh, you see it's nicely carbonated. It has a very nice golden color. Um, crisp golden color, nice and nicely carbonated. Wow, has a great aroma, very, very hoppy. A little bit of a citrusy, hoppy um, smell to it. Smells very nice. Uh, yeah, the, the head is very foamy and thick. And uh, I read a little bit about it on Beer Advocate, it said that the head lacing, um, the head sustains pretty well which is good all right and it's definitely kind of smells like a boston lager or something very hoppy and strong so i'm going to dive right in and give it its first test wow very hoppy very hoppy and citrusy a little bit fruity um yeah, I read that the uh, taste is uh, the grapefruit flavor and other citrus flavors in it. Um, and it definitely does taste like a grapefruit hoppy taste. Wow. Robust. This definitely has a real robust taste. As you can see, the head is still pretty foamy and staying that way um yeah this is uh this is a really good beer it kind of reminds me of like i said a boston lager or a brooklyn lager um it's a session ipa so you can drink these in a session you know it's one of those beers and it said it would go good with some foods um some of the foods it said it would go good with um let's see here all right oh that's the apple huh Let's see what it's got to say here. Good. Spicy foods, pesto, grilled salmon, soy-based dishes, pizza, and vintage cheddar. Yeah, those definitely do sound good. This is something that would go good with like a, a pesto pasta dish or a, you know, chicken carbonara, something, you know, little zest to it. This definitely would uh, add some flavor. So it's a great beer, and um, I like it a lot. It's a quality beer. Dogfish Head um, is rated some of the highest quality beers, and uh, I agree, they are good. There's another uh, Dogfish beer I want to try that's only 30 IBUs. It's called the Apperhop, so I'm looking forward to that. Very robust taste. I mean, this beer is a, a beer that you could have with dinner. Um, you know, you make yourself a nice dish of whatever you like, and this would go great with it. Um, this is up there with a Samuel Adams or, you know, a Brooklyn Lager or anything like that. But it's an India Pale Ale, and it definitely uh, meets up to the standard of being very hoppy. And um, to grade this beer based on the 
all factors, the aroma, which is great, the color, which is beautiful, golden color, the taste, magnificent, the head is still there, um, overall drinkability is good, I mean, this beer is a great beer overall, and there's nothing bad to say about it as far as I'm concerned, I really like it, um, and it's a solid A for me, so on a grading scale of 1 out of 5, um, this would be, this would be like a 4.9. Um, or a five. I'm gonna give it a five. Okay, so it's it's an A, but it's an A uh, it's an A minus. Um, beers that are really good, I would give it a higher grade. So it's a five beer, which means it's a top notch quality beer. Um, so cheers, and uh, let me see. I'll finish it for you guys. Look at that. An A. Five out of five for the India, for the Dogfish Head India Pale Ale.